Questions emerged in Newberry Township after the Ohio Division of Wildlife euthanized a pair of mute swans this week. Some may think it's cruel. As our Carl Bachtel explains, the plan has increased trumpeter swan numbers. The wetland at Auburn and Pekin Roads looks a bit empty today. Muskrats are still busy, but two invasive mute swans that called this place home are gone killed by the Ohio Division of Wildlife. Emotions do run high. We don't celebrate this part of our wildlife management approach. That widely accepted management approach is to euthanize feral mute swans, an invasive species from Asia. They push out Ohio's native trumpeter swans, a threatened species. The plan, though cruel on its face, is working. We can see that the graph that the, the figures continue to climb and we had the highest number of signets ever reported since the program began in 1996. The state checked with the landowner and had permission to safely and quickly remove them. The two swans were not banded or pets. Anyone who wants to have mute swans can, can do that, but they have to be responsible pet owners. So we do work with landowners who have mute swans. The science-based management plan is for the greater good of native species like trumpeter swans, but a sad end for the mute swans. They're, they're large, bright, white, beautiful animals, but they just don't belong here. In Newberry Township, Carl Bachtel, 3 News.